to add 11, a horrifying crime in Howard County. An Ellicott City father is dead, and police have charged the man's 14-year-old daughter and her boyfriend with his murder. The father was found stabbed to death inside his home on Winding Ross Way. Robert Lyle spoke with neighbors there. He's live outside county police headquarters with the latest. Robert. Howard County police are calling this a murder plot two months in the making with the victim's own daughter standing accused of using text messages to communicate with her boyfriend on how, where, even when to stab her father to death. We're shocked and you know, this is a pretty quiet neighborhood. Those who've lived next door to 58 year old Dennis Lane for years are stunned. He was stabbed to death early this morning. It's a complete shock. Lane embodied the suburban dad, they say, planning the neighborhood 4th of July party every year and constantly doting on his youngest daughter, Morgan Lane Arnold. He's extremely close to his daughter. They're together all the time at school and PTA and, you know, in the neighborhood. But Howard County police say the 14 year old reserved her affections for 19 year old Jason Bulmer, a relationship that turned murderous. The plan, say police, Arnold left open the sliding glass door for Balmer to enter after her dad and his fiance went to bed. As the popular Howard County blogger and podcast host slept, police say his own daughter instructed her boyfriend to deliver the deadly stabbing. His fiance awoke and dialed 911. Tonight, she was home but wouldn't answer the door. Morgan Arnold's best friend did talk, saying she and Bulmer were diagnosed with Asperger's syndrome, a high functioning form of autism. Police say they found Bulmer and Arnold in an upstairs bedroom, Bulmer allegedly covered in blood. Now, in fact, Morgan Arnold is 14 years old and her name and image are being released because police are charging her as an adult. In fact, she and Jason Bulmer both face charges of first and second degree murder as well as conspiracy to commit murder. At this hour, police say they have no idea what the motive behind this murder could be. Live in Ellicott City, I'm Robert Lyles, ABC 7 News.